So how many one fourth cups are in one and one half cup? And here's how you figure it out. So first, just visually thinking about this, that's a quarter cup right there. So if we fill all of these in, that's the one cup, that's the one cup here, and then half a cup over here, you can see that that's half. So now you can count these quarter cups up. You have one, two, three, four, five, six. So six quarter cups, six one fourth of a cup measures in one and one half cup. So that's the way to think about it visually. Let's do this mathematically. So let's look at our one and a half cup here. We have one and one half cup, but let's change this to a mixed number. That's gonna be easier to deal with. So one times two, that's two. Two plus one is three, then we bring the two across. So this is the same as one and a half cup. Let's work with this. And I'm gonna take our one and a half cup and divide it by a quarter cup, by one fourth cup. The way we do this, instead of division though, we can get rid of this, we can do multiplication if we take the reciprocal of one fourth. So we're gonna move the one down to the bottom and then the four goes up to the top and that's the reciprocal of one fourth. So now we can do our multiplication. Three times four is 12, two times one is two, 12 divided by two, that's six. And that's what we found before. It takes one, two, three, four, five, six of these quarter cups right here to make one and one half cup. It's Dr. B. Thanks for watching.